What is up guys, Rekus here with a new video and today our world boss, the bear boss, got defeated. So now we're on the way to actually claim the loot and see what happens. Last time there was an animation. Let's press that button and let's see what happens. Ah, there seems to be another kill animation. And he drops loot. Very nice. Yeah. We made it in the top 20, so that is good, even though I, I was a bit unlucky with the um, drops that I had afterwards. Because, well, I didn't really get any good uh, good fights uh, towards the end, which was a bit sad. Uh, but yeah, challenged 63 times, so that's quite a lot. Uh, we are here, there, is decent. 11 days kill time was faster than I expected. Um, kind of decent, I guess even though uh, you get the best loot at 8 days, which I think was kind of impossible. We got the Bear Hunter uh, a title, 2000 Hero Essence, which isn't a lot. I take the Invite Letters, those are kind of nice. And of course our special loot, the 10 Twilight Essence, which is not really a whole lot. Uh, we get the Fierce Roar uh, frame and we have the Bear Hunter title. I think we equip that right now, I think that was pretty cool. Is there a pack again? Last time there was a pack. Again there is a pack, so... Uh, what do we have here? We have 360 Hero Essence, which was insane last time. On the Wolf Boss, if you remember, that was quite the pack. It was quite insane. Now, really, feels a bit less insane, even though there's still a lot of Hero Essence. I mean, I'm not entirely sure if I'm going to buy it. And I bought it. <laughs> I mean, compared to this one, it's actually quite decent. Look at this. This is actually like a, a similar one, you could say. We have a, a little bit of gems in here, but for the other one, we had a ton of hero essence. So I guess that's kind of nice. And now the bear is actually back to its tree form that we can click and, of course, view the screen we already saw. Uh, pretty, pretty cool. Um, beyond that, there's, of course, the frame. Let's check that out. I think I want to equip it, actually. Because it is pretty, pretty nice. We have the title, Bear Hunter title. Let's equip that, save. Uh, and I kind of want to have the frame as well. Your inky plume has expired. Okay, that is that is uh, all right. I can live with that. It is actually this one, Fierce Raw. I think it looks kind of good. I will currently have this one equipped, but I think uh, this one is actually a bit cooler. I like the wolf one too, though. The wolf one had the bit of the red there. I think that was pretty nice as well. Let's equip the alpha bear one. Pretty nice. Let's check out the title in game. Bear Hunter. I think that looks pretty cool. I think that honestly looks pretty cool, even from further away. Yeah, can definitely do that. That's pretty nice. What I also did on top of that, I waited an entire day to to get this S tier. I uh, I wanted to claim it yesterday. It was unlocked yesterday, but I waited an entire day. I'm not exactly sure who I'm hoping for. I mean, you can get every single hero only one time. So is a bit of a question who I want. Uh, I'm pretty open. Let's just see who we get. Let's watch it. Uh, that is... I forgot her name. <laughs> oh my god, I forgot her name. Oh, that is so sad. <laughs> uh, Atalanta, exactly. I mean, I don't really need her, let's be honest but, about that. But yeah, you can only get every single hero one time, then it says on, obtained. I mean, from the heroes that were in here that are probably still kind of neat. I mean, I still need Granny. Granny would have been kind of good. I don't have Granny upgraded, uh, so that would have been kind of insane to get her. Mm. Beyond that, I think my Heaven is not uh, S+, so would have been good as well at that point. And uh, the next thing we have is actually also quite insane. Um, level 300. Because we have uh, all the materials, we actually have a bit more because I also got that yesterday and didn't want to make the video or put that all in one video. So let's unlock level 300 with you guys together. Bam. And it's actually a level up bonus. We get 100 gems there, uh, which I don't know. Somebody had to code this for 100 gems. But all right, we can actually instantly go to 301. Oh, this is now every single time you level, you get 100 gems? That is kind of fancy. Is that in the roots? Not really. Doesn't tell you. So you really get 100 gems every single time you level up there? It's fancy, but it's now 7,500. It was way cheaper before. It is kind of interesting. The game is really kind of designed to put all of the players rather close together in that sense. 
um, which is which is fairly interesting. I didn't really expect that. Um, but we still have the final push going, so uh, we still get the extra rewards here, which means for me that I get kind of a ton of uh, essence every day, but everybody else, of course, too. And there has been a bit of a discussion on that because some people were a bit unhappy when they wailed on the packs early on and said like okay i bought those hero essence packs and now people get this insane push and get to the same level that i am or get to 240 very fast and i mean obviously um if you see the hero power the level link to 240 is really what gives you the most power so if you have the hero essence packs very early on then you get a ton of power on your way to 240 and afterwards you see those extra levels and i mean they seem fancy but i think even with getting some more heroes I got like 2 million power ever since for the last 61 levels or something like that. So uh, we really didn't increase that much in power. It gave me way more power when I uh, got Burial and got a new hero with him because this guy alone uh, has like 254k power. So it was a huge power boost to get him. And if I upgrade the rest to Supreme Plus, then of course I would get a bit more as well. Um, and yeah, so we, we kind of don't get a lot of power anymore after Resonance 240. And uh, still, I have to say, I think it's okay. I think it's okay. We now have the Season of Strife coming up. We have this uh, Song of Strife event here um, where we can already look in the season, by the way, if you didn't check that out. Season features is now available. And um, beyond that, we can actually see, uh, well, we can see the release date. There is some stuff here in game uh, available in eight days, it says. So uh, not really... A whole lot of time to wait uh, and we are a bit prepared for that not even, uh, only a bit prepared we are very prepared uh, for this because well you all got all, got all of the rewards um, if you wait early in the beginning uh, you got the ranking rewards you were mostly in the top 10 or top 20 uh, if you spent for this so I think you get got uh, some extra rewards there we got some cosmetics of course but um, extra temporal essence that's 100% uh, more temporal essence compared to uh, like the lower place if you were outside the top 100 you didn't even get temporal essence so that of course will mean that you guys have better weapons and if you wait for the weapons as well i mean uh, free to play really can't keep up so i think it's it's a it's a senseless discussion in the end um of course it is a bit of a weird move compared to other games but i think it's a very good one it's a very good one that allows all of the players to start in the season of strife together have fun there enjoy the new things get the new heroes and uh, I think that will be very cool once it starts in eight days. So uh, definitely, definitely, I think we will uh, do that together. And we will make a stream, obviously. I mean, last time when we did a stream for Floribel release, that was kind of fun. We will do a stream. I'm not entirely sure how we designed it yet. I think we're going to have to do quite a ton. Because I want to do summons, obviously, because there will be a new rate up. Uh, and on, on the other hand, I kind of also... Uh, want to do the new story, the new quests, the new unlock systems, want to do the seasonal stuff. So there's so much to do there. Uh, I'm not entirely sure how we are going to going to approach that. I think we're going to start with an hero and some summons. I think that's going to be the coolest part. Uh, and probably just afterwards do a stream and uh, show off all of the new, uh, the new systems, all of the new story, all of that. Uh, I think that will be kind of fancy. So uh, definitely stay tuned for that. I will still announce the stream. Uh, on my live stream tab that should be fairly fancy and uh, by the way if you haven't watched it already now that Thorin just died there for, our, for us I also made the Thorin video currently I'm working on making like a review for every single character and I thought about this because there is the problem obviously with the hero skill there will be a seasonal hero skill I think once we get the new season and I see the new hero skill, I'm going to make like a pin post on every one of those heroes. But till then, you can use the reviews and check out the heroes that you maybe don't know too much about. And maybe that's interesting for you. Maybe you will find something new and some skill that you didn't understand yet or didn't know about yet. That's a horrible damage. I definitely have to prove that. But other than that, I wish you a great day. And we'll see us in the next one.